Welcome aboard the 747 Ford Cargo Bay. Looks rather empty, doesn't it? Well, it looks to be deceiving. Now, if we look down at the right hand side of the freight bay, behind those sidewall panels, we, we will be able to find the passenger and crew emergency oxygen bowls, which provide oxygen to passengers and crew in the event of a decompression, and the two cargo bay fire extinguisher bottles which are for both the forward and aft freight bays. At the back, at the rear of, of the cargo bay, is a fire retardant curtain and behind that curtain are the three potable water tanks plus a compressor to pressurise them on the ground and then behind that is the centre wing box um, which contains a centre wing tank. Down the left hand side, behind some of the forward most panels, are the fans that provide cooling air for the equipment cooling. And as we leave the bay, you can see the cargo loading mechanism in the floor there at the, by the door. And the various guide wheels that run the pa cargo pallets in and out. Now we're in the main equipment centre which contains the electrical distribution panels for the aircraft and all the various circuit breakers to major systems and in this part of the aircraft is the known as the forward right hand crawlway we have the malware card file which generates all the warnings uh, the aircraft the main battery which is one of two the second battery, is known as the AP battery, is at the back of the aeroplane, in the rear cabin. Up there we have the battery chargers, the transform rectifier units, and the weather radars, and the static inverter. And this is the rack of electrical control equipment, flight control computers, VHF radio transceivers, air data computers, uh, uh, high frequency radio transceivers, uh, cell call, multi mode rece uh, receivers, uh, inertial reference units, and various other boxes that control aircraft systems. Now, this is the left hand side of the aeroplane and the left hand electrical power distribution panels uh, back into the forward freight bay through that door, air data computer. Generator control units at the top there. Uh, left hand crawlway up around the nose gear there, and engine control cards up there. And another card file mainly controlling the engine smoke, oh sorry, engine fire detection and APU fire detection. And before we go, here's a quick look under the fairings underneath the wing of the flap drive unit. As you can see, it doesn't take up too much of the wing and it is bolted straight underneath the rear spar. Well, thank you for watching. I hope this has been informative. See you next time.